A freshman at the University of Hartford has been arrested after revealing on social media how she poisoned her roommate to force her to move out. Welcome back to What's Trending, I'm Ava Gordy. Be sure to like this video and subscribe for more crazy stories. Chanel Rowe moved out of her dorm after a few months. She and her roommate, Brianna Brochu, didn't get along. I moved out about two weeks ago. And I moved out because I felt like I was unwanted in my own room. Chanel explains in a Facebook video that she also started to get sick. It started with throat pain, and I thought maybe because it's cold up here, colder up here, I'm just probably catching a cold. It got to the point where I had extreme throat pain that I couldn't sleep to the point where I couldn't speak. Chanel spent her own money to visit the campus clinic. The test would come back negative, but she was prescribed antibiotics. While she was battling this mysterious illness, Chanel decided that her roommate situation wasn't working out and wanted to move out. As she was moving out of her old building and into her new place, she was approached by two RAs and a friend. They showed her this Instagram comment posted by Brianna, which read, Finally did it. Yo girl got rid of her roommate. After one and a half months of spitting in her coconut oil, putting moldy clam dips in her lotions, rubbing used tampons on her backpack, putting her toothbrush places where the sun doesn't shine, and so much more I can finally say goodbye to Jamaican Barbie. It's f***ing disgusting. <laughs> Brianna also made Snapchat evidence of her abuse. Home, girl, bad decisions. Brianna filmed herself spitting into Chanel's organic coconut oil. She snapped a photo of moldy clam dip she kept just to poison Chanel's lotion. And Brianna also showed off the stain she left with a used tampon on Chanel's Steve Madden bag. God, never could I hate someone this much, never. Also, like, even if I hated someone this much and did all of it, I wouldn't share it. Brianna also admitted to police that she licked her roommate's spoons, forks, and knives often. According to the police report, Brianna blamed Chanel for creating a hostile environment. Brianna says she began to lash out because of Chanel's rude behavior, not compromising, and posting Snapchat videos of me sleeping and making fun of my snoring. So I put her toothbrush in my butthole, dude. Like, that is what she deserved because she made fun of my snoring. In her Facebook video, Chanel describes the roommate dynamic a little differently. Mind you, I was really super nice with my roommate. Like, I shared my microwave, shared my fridge, fed her fish, she left every weekend. At first, the complaint was handled by the school's Office of Public Safety, albeit pretty poorly. Chanel said at first she was told by the school she may or may not hear anything back about her complaint. Days later, she was asked to sign a no contact agreement, which said Chanel could not contact Brianna and Chanel would face expulsion for speaking publicly about the incident. This gag order also meant that she couldn't press charges against Brianna with the West Hartford police. Chanel posted her story to Facebook so something would be done. Soon, West Hartford police arrested Brianna Brochu, charging her with third-degree criminal mischief and second-degree breach of peace. Police will be requesting to add a third charge of intimidation based on bigotry or bias. Brianna has also been expelled from the university. So guys, have you ever had a roommate from hell? Let us know in the comments below. Like this video and subscribe for more What's Trending.